Hello everybody, this is Shadow Rosier here bringing you another episode of Yogg's Cast Complete Pack. I believe this is episode something. I won't lie, I'm losing track of numbers. But that's besides the point. I've done a few things off camera since the last one. Just mainly a lot, slightly cosmetic, slightly useful, and also my FPS is still fluctuating. No freaking idea what's causing it, but worst case scenario, I'll have it fixed before I do something I want to do later. But eh, that's a few episodes away if we're lucky. Okay. Now then, let's show you guys what's been going on. Back there you can see a little bit of a sneak preview. We'll start in the front because there's a simple thing I did here. I basically turned off this because I filled up the freaking thing. And I also took out all the obsidian because way too much. Now then, over here's the ugly smeltery that I have no idea how to make look better. I have yet to consult my friend on that. And over here is my sheep and my cow farms, because I freaking needed them. Because, well, I freaking needed them. Also, guys, you're wondering where I have melon from. I'm not sure if it was in the last episode, but basically, I, I remember in the last episode I made the sieve. Basically, I got seeds. I got various melon and pumpkin seeds from that. And as I said, I was going to be working on this. I have organized the fields a little better. Here's the food from uh, Magical Crops. Here's just a wheat field. Build. Here is my witchery one that I just sort of put in a nice pattern. And here's my slowly growing individual item one for her, uh, Magical Crops. These over here is my melon and my... My pumpkin, these are sort of the equivalent of how I'm doing like the reeds, except you can't exactly walk through them. Over here are my potatoes and my carrots. I finally got those because of, well, the sieve. Oh, yeah, speaking of which, let's do this and plant them because that will just make things so much easier for us later on. Okay, that's good. Now let's go diagonal just because I like changing it up. One, two, three. One, two. Perfect. Now then, over here quickly. Oh yeah, over here I sort of did a little bit of a design thing there. I'll show you in a moment. Right, now I just want to take care of this before I forget because you guys know me. I forget things. Right now, I also have a f right now, guys. I actually have a few new series in the works. I'm going to be trying to start. Also, I start finally started Dragon Age 2 last night. Took me forever to get to it, but I'm really glad I did. I am enjoying it. A little frustrated at the beginning because uh, hard mode. That that immediate leap from switch from playing a normal mode game to hard is just. It, I can ne It always gets me. I guess. Over here is a field yet to be decided. Over there is just a pure essence. Is just essence crops. Damn it. I'm pissed off at myself. I'll be back in a moment. And by back in a moment, I mean I just want to run over here and grab have my who? Where the? No, that's not a good sign. Where's my watering can? Because you guys know I had a watering can. I don't know where the hell it just went though. I had it there earlier. Let's shift right click on it with an empty hand just to be safe. Yeah, it's not a good sign. Might have gotten away because I updated the mod pack. It might have been like an item conflict thing. So it's just like, screw this thing. It doesn't exist. We'll delete it. Which is an unfortunate item conflict thing, but eh. It could have been worse. Well, I'm good with that. Now then, I will quickly go over here and just show you a little bit of like an architectural thing I did. I sort of thought that when I cleared this out, it would look a little boring, so I sort of did a little bit of this. Still have to do a little there, but I'm just too lazy, to be honest. Basically, though, a simplistic design. And in retrospect, I screwed up over there, but... Actually, no. If I can do that same design over here, then it'll have symmetry. And, of course, symmetry is, like, key in Minecraft. But that's another story. Today, guys, there's a mod I want to start that 
I've been procrastinating on. I'll leave it at that. You guys will see in a few moments what that mod is, but first I have to get the proper materials. Also, I got an apple tree. Apparently, apple trees work. Actually exist. I did not... It, all you really have to do to get an apple tree is do this, plant the apple core, then you get one of those. And then occasionally it just drops freaking apples that you can just turn into more sapling things for the tree. This is my slowly growing food chest. I haven't really touched this stuff because I'm too lazy and not crazy. Okay, what was I... Oh yeah. I believe it's... This is the re the first part of the recipe. Next up, I gotta get my force shears. If you guys know where I'm going with this, congratulations. You're ahead of the ball. One, two, three. Yeah, let's do it to all of them, why not? They'll get warm eventually. Can't do it to the babies. Sort of good, actually. So now I have a bunch of orange cows. So many things wrong with that. Okay, step one, almost completed. Step one, completed. If you guys haven't figured it out yet, keep waiting. Even though I didn't retrospect, I do have some necessary materials. One, two, three. If all you guys haven't seen my Resident Rise series or Slash Chaos build, I'd like you to check it out. You don't have to, but I'd really like it if you did. Worst case scenario, just give me a like on it. Speaking of which, give me a like on these videos because... I'm not, I'm a nice person. Now then, there should be a this that stuff should be somewhere over here. I'm trying to remember. There it is. It's across the river. So much sugarcane I'm having grow near me, which is actually a smart thing, guys, because the more sugarcane you have growing near you, the just it's useful because. Uh, depending on the mod pack at least, but I still say it's useful. Good. Here's the pool of it. Put this here. This is a pool of essence. Put the book and watch the magic. <laughs> Literal magic. Oh, maybe it's because I have my music low. It didn't do... It's supposed to have, like, a little music, but... First off, Ars Compendium. I've gotten it. Oh, yeah. I believe there's something I need to do first. The Ars UI. Slash A-M-U-I-C-F-G. Slash A-M-U-I-C-F-G. I always change this around. First off, I knew... Oh, crap. Options. Uh, actually, why not? Let's move this a little. I am actually thinking I probably screwed this up. Okay, slash A M U I C F G R E S E T. Okay, I'm pissed off because I'm not sure if I... S Hold on. No, I screwed it up. Well, too late for that. In the meantime, I will literally just move this in an interesting way. Trying to, like, give it some semblance of a... Option... Or maybe I did do it right. Minimal HUD. Numeric, I always have. Just usually I have it at the bottom of it, but I guess in this case I'll have it at the top. And... Let's see, any final options? Nope. Perfect. Actually, damn it. My perfectionism. It hurts. This will have to... Actually... Hmm. 
Move that like that. Move this like that. That like that. That like that. Move this on top of this. Yeah, this thing's just slightly annoying. I apologize. Just... God dang it. Uh, I just want to move you a few inches to the side. You also a few inches to the side. That's much better. Well, guys, I've officially started Ars Magico once again. Speaking of which, Murder Squid. You need lots of ink sacks for this. Luckily, I have a freaking river that will give me them. Actually, I can also make this the ink I'll need via freaking magical crops now. Just all I have to do is use this dye ink. And I have a feeling some of you who are actually know about magical crops is where I'm going to put half this stuff. Well, I haven't finished the area yet for, like, for it, but I have a general, like, location finished up. Let me just head around and here. The location's pretty simple because I don't have the energy to, to deal with like some more complicated. I just have to make it look better. Right here. I basically made a freaking just gigantic room that the ceiling is going to have a secondary layer so I can ha have like pipes and lights under here. But in the meantime, it's like a freaking temporary thing. Oh, yeah, speaking of which, waypoints, corner, delete. So while I'm here, let's just put that there, and let's start a little of this. I already know all this crud, but I basically will let, I'll just like, if you guys want to read some of this, just pause it or look it up on the wiki. I don't want to be rude, but a lot of stuff to do. Not all the time. Soulbound. And you can face the soulbound channel, apply to items like such enchantments, blah, 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 or respond to the same slot inventory. Solbet has a maximum enchant level of 1. Magic resistance. Okay. Magic level. Mana. Sorry if I'm just not even showing you all of it, but I have to start making stuff. Let's see. Everstone. Um, I might make some of that later. Particle emitter is more for fun. Chiseled stone. That it has a use. Oculus is what we need to make, though. And it even has, like, a thing where it shows other things you can make. So, let's see, I need three stone brick, glass, two coal, and some topaz. That's reasonable. Full price? Let's see. Two coal. Where's the topaz? One glass, which would be in construction material. No, maybe it's not there, not there. Here you are. And three stone brick. Literally don't have enough. Oh, I can just turn these into them in retrospect. Just let me get my chisel out from here. Stone bricks. Made a ton of them. And put this back here. Oh yeah, well Matt, let's bring a freaking let's get a crafting station down there for the sake of you always need a crafting station. Actually I think I'll probably need two. So let's make two. I believe turn one of these into a regular crafting station. The other one I need is a table for some reason, because I think one of the recipes requires a table, but first, gotta clean my glasses. They're getting a little bit scuffy. And by scuffy I mean I don't know how the hell this happens. Glasses back on, and let's head on down. Let's see. I'm just really keeping a form of symmetry going, so why not? Now then, oh, see. Actually, let's do this without looking up the NEI recipe. I'm going to do this all from memory. Hey, or I will look in the book itself. Oculus, Creato. Sorry, Harry Potter fan. The Oculus. New entry unlocked. New entries, I'd assume. Now it has stuff about shapes, where you can either go projectile. You can even access some of those, which is a weird feature. It's like, if this leads into something else, it will show you like the materials necessary, but you can't unlock it yet. 
I just say I made sure stage compendium was on because I find it cheaty how you, how people do that. Locks. Let's see. I need to make an inscription table and a lectern. Obtaining skill points. Well, I'm gonna go with the most sim. I'm gonna go with projectile. And then I'm gonna learn touch. Yeah. Uh, sorry. And dig because t pretty much touch dig is a normally common spell, but I'm gonna make projectile dig because more effective. Now then, we gotta make a lectern. And before anything else. Oh, and now a lectern. I need to make an inscription table, which is... See, spell parchment is stick in that. Let's head on. Let's sleep for the night. Grab some... Um, uh, grab a bunch of my sugar cane from out there, and we'll make some. Come on. That's better. Yeah, I'm sort of taking a break from the quest book. I do plan doing all the magics in this mod pack is one of my goals. But at the moment, my current goal is just to punch sugar. Because it's the easiest thing I can do. Okay, that should be good. But enough for what I need. Followed by that, let's turn this into paper. That should give me ten each, so good. Okay, let's find some... Okay, let's just turn that into that. I'm gonna rush when it comes to some of this, so I'm just like not trying. Also, I finally found feces. Another sentence I really never wanted to say today. You know what? Screw the melon seeds. Okay. Now then make a bunch of wood. For the oculus, I will need three slabs and some planks. Wonder, do I have any slabs? Yes, I do. Ooh, that saves us a lot of time. That goes like that. I believe it's one torch. Then... Head over here quickly. Oh yeah, let's put away the, the ruby hoe. Don't need that. Actually, let's make a few of these. You need a decent amount. Amount of freaking these. Perfect. It, and then one of these, and a feather. God dang it, I forgot you need feathers. Actually, is there a recipe for feather? If there is one, that would be awesome. I need air essence. Wait, air essence has a use? Like that? I did not. I thought air essence was like for a, a different mod entirely. Like... Let me just take a look if this Earth Essence has another use. Okay, I misunderstood. When I saw these, they look like the shards from Thomcraft, so I just... In retrospect, now it makes sense. Why the hell would they make stuff like that, then? So let's see what Water Essence can become. Okay. That's actually interesting. Okay, I just need three. Well, that takes care of me ever needing a chicken again. Wonder will it work either? Yep, either way, and I got six feathers. So I got everything I need for the lectern already. I don't even need to deal with chickens because they can be a little bit douchebaggy. Head on down, and yes, I just called a chicken a douchebag. You know what? That actually works. Now the knee drink of water. Oh no. The NEI for this is bugged. Projectile dig. Or maybe it's... They really... I heard they really made it weird. Yeah, at least one component. Let's see if they, how they changed it. 
Hmm. Yeah, I know. Projectile. Put the digs. Oh, maybe I just gotta put it here. Projectile dig, hopefully. I heard they made some changes according to a buddy of mine, so I'm just like, I'm hoping they didn't really nerf this, because freaking Ars Magica is one of the best mods. And if they nerfed spellmaking somehow, or just did something stupid, I would be a little disappointed. Okay. In this case, I need a book and quill. See, the regular book recipe is leather and paper. I'll make a bunch of these because, well, you need a bunch. Okay. This is the general recipe. I'll put that there and this here. Here because I'm in a freaking rush. That here, that here. And I know I have ink already. Way too much ink. Okay, now. Let's just put these in here, which is literally no use at the moment. I'll figure out what to do with this crafting table later. Gotta get this book and quill downstairs. New Ars Magica. Oh yeah, soon they're gonna be updating, like I believe most mods are finally reaching the 1.7 update, which is great news for people who mod things. Okay, I'll just pretty much do this E-R-O-J-E-C-T-I-L-E. -E. Dig. I'm just going with the simple name for the spell. Good. Projectile dig. Project Shape group 1, shape group 2, combination dig. I'm not even sure if the spell's going to work anymore. I'm nervous now. Okay. Now then, I know I need to make a crafting altar, which is really just complicated. <laughs> so okay, it's not that complicated. It's a relatively simple build. Actually, I think I have some witch wood. I think I'll s actually okay, let's just first make all the other stuff before I actually get into that. So, a lectern just three slabs and a piece of wood. Okay, so I need three slabs. Actually, I want six slabs. That's because I want to make two of these. One for the sake of the crafting altar, the other sake just for using it because they're useful. Next up, magic wall, two Vintian dust, and some stone. Okay, before anything else, let me get some stone from upstairs. Or at least some cobblestone, and then I'll just cook it. Do I even have. Nope, no stone. Let's get two stacks. Better to be safe than sorry. Me and I'll put one stack here, one stack here. Move that there, take that. Get some of my lava. And also, full of lava. Oh yeah, eat. Pretty much now I at least have a way better source of food. I could keep myself and maybe seven others alive. But enough time for daydreaming. Need Vintium Dust. Which means I need Vintium Ore. Okay, how do I... Okay, by smelting it, I get one. Redstone Furnace, one. Pulverizer doubles it. I believe the most you can get via this is if you use, like, a special method, but... I don't... I'm not that advanced in Ars Magica yet to do it, so... Oops. I'll just take half of this put in the pulverizer and another bucket of lava just to be safe and yeah a little bit of a frame rate drop take the stone take the ventium dust and let's quickly make this I believe I only need to make one magic wa one yeah this is more than enough it's just really cool looking but you you always do need tons of ventium dust so I'll take a little more from it, or later. Now let's head on down. Ah, uh, under, under my house, much calmer. Okay. 
got everything except for the lever and the uh, crafting altar, which is freaking Ventium and a stone. I can do that right now. That looks... Wait. Okay, that just looks so much uh, nicer than the previous like design they had for the crafting altar and this texture. Now then, I've got to find... Ugh, gotta find... I have some witch wood in here. Yep, here it is. I'm gonna turn this all into planks. Because I want to use this for the crafting altar. Now that I'm going down, let's head on back. Just pause that. So I basically... Okay, for this... For the ne for the regular stuff, I can either use stone wood, I can use regular wood planks, stone bricks, sandstone for level one effect, bricks of, e of most kinds apparently are wait regular brick is for two, which wood is a plus two, nether stuff way too expensive for me. Well, I think for the caps, I'll either go lapis or coal, or redstone. Those are my three choices, but. I'm going to go with the witch wood for at least part of this. I already know the general measurements it has to be. I believe it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. I made a cross. Yep. 5 in all directions, then just seal it up. Oh yeah, just to be safe. Really? Okay, good. Now I think, let, let's see, the next stage is put down this stuff. I'll set it so that way I go, for, since my ladder is there, I'll pretty much like go straight through and then like from here, so. Good. One, two, three, four, five, six. The lectern, I'll have it an angle. Speaking of an angle, let's uh, put A, my other lectern right here. And B, put my other, other lectern. Actually, nah. I prefer this thing at like a side angle just because it feels right. Like you're just reading it off that, you know? Okay. One, two... Three, four, five, six. A new entry unlocked already. What the hell did I unlock? Magician's workbench. Ooh. Planks. That's what I need the crafting tables for. Magician's workbench is literally just a crafting table for Ars Magica. So two of those, a piece of wood. Yeah, I think I could do this. Also, I have to get some other material. So let's see. God dang it! I'm not sure what the other material. Oh, I'll take the. I'll take like. Let's see. I believe I need five of those. Let's. Th oh yeah, four shears. Make him get closer. Or just completely ignore him. Either of those options will work for me at the moment. Okay, I'm doing this just to save us all time. And god damn it, they killed one of my sheep. Well, I don't have the energy to deal with them at the moment. I have to make this freaking thing, which is, I believe, now, uh... What the... There it is. Carpet. Put the wool in here. I'm in a rush. Need one more crafting table. Oh, and I'll just take all of these. You know what? I'll just take a bunch of these too because I'm going to need it anyway. And one more crafting table. Okay. Let's head on downstairs. And at least finish up this thing before I do anything else. Let me get the recipe pulled up. Two crafting tables, that, 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 and that. 
Okay, I think I got it. That goes there. That. Oh no! Wait, wait! I'm stupid. That. For... Oh no! Wait, I already got the what? No, I don't. I'm stupid today. That goes there. That goes there. That goes there. That goes here. Those go there. And just two more ingredients off the top of my. Oh yeah. Wait, what ingredient am I forgetting? Oh, the slabs, of course. And magician's workbench completed. Okay, let's put down the magician's workbench here. Wrong thing. Okay. Modifiers, structures, crafting altar. Let's see, the next layer, since I'm wondering if I can mix and match, let's see, I'll go... Honestly... Well, guys, that's my very alar loud alarm if you didn't hear it, but... Screw you, alarm. I want to le- Wait, actually... Let's use stone, just because I think that might look a little nicer. But let's make sure that's actually stone in this, because... Cycle. Quartz. Nether brick. Cobblestone. Bricks. Yeah, I think regular wood will probably look at least a little better. Unfortunately. It's like I just don't like having to use wood as a material at times. One, two, three, four. Okay, I finished this basic part of the structure. What I got left is to put to get some stairs, stairs down, and this stuff. I'll do that in the next episode though, guys. So oh this has been Shadow Ruler Zero. And let's begin our magical adventure. Bye.